Hi everybody, it's Kayla, and welcome back to Fixer Upper, the show where I usually attempt to fix up your houses, but today, fix up one of EA's community lots from Cats and Dogs. This is Club Calico. Actually, this is my renovated version, um, but I always start in my library, so I want to show you that way, but this is, this is Club Calico. Um, okay, I'm, also my sin is dying, don't worry about it. Um, go into tab mode, you can't even see. Uh, so basically, you guys, today we're going to renovate this lot um, that is in in Brindleton Bay. I almost said Windenburg. That's false. Um, but it's this like yacht club area. Um, that's really pretty. Like the area around it is absolutely gorgeous. As you can see, it's just that the, the yacht club itself could use some help. And so we're going to fix it. I just, I have a lot of issues with windows. Okay. That's my main problem. Also the, the roofing is kind of a situation that I want to fix, but otherwise great place. Um, so when you first walk in and the landscaping too, oh dear God. Okay. I have a lot of complaints. Um, when you first walk into the build, uh, you find this beautiful area. It's it's supposed to be this yacht club that used to be a yacht club, but now it's like open to everyone. Um, but I still like to think it's a yacht club because I think that's fun. Um, but in here, so you have like this cute like lounge area. Um, I believe it's actually technically a lounge if I remember correctly, but I could be wrong. Don't quote me on that. It is a lounge. I was right. Heck yeah. Um, so it's look at the yacht club. Isn't that pretty? Ooh, it's beautiful. Anyway, you can't actually get over here, but um, it's just, it's fun to look at all these boats and stuff around here. It's just, it's really pretty, okay? Um, but yeah, so, oh, I got distracted again. So when you first walk in, you find the lounge area. Oh no. Oh, we've got like some cute like seating, um, some nice plants, a check-in area. We've got some public restrooms, as you can see. Um, looking good. <laughs> Giant windows. Actually, I kind of like that. I got rid of it, but you know, <laughs> over here, it's kind of a big empty space, which is fair because EA's builds always have to be like this because they have to make them so everyone can play in them. So they're kind of empty looking. Um, that's Art Giordano looking like he has to pee really bad. Um, he comes with a build. Over here, it's just, it's a pretty walkway and stuff. Um, nice seating outside, beautiful giant pool. Um, over here is like a nice, I'm going to say almost like a gazebo kind of deal, but it's connected. So I don't know if there's like a term for that, that I don't know, but it's cute. Um, and that's the whole place. Look, see, it blends into the lot very well. Cause like over here, not on the lot itself, but there's like a wedding arch and stuff. Um, and it's just, it's really pretty. And that's my Sim dying in the pool. <laughs> uh, but I just like the roofing is kind of weird. I feel like it needs some help. And so I wanted to renovate it and therefore I did. <laughs> But let's go ahead and jump right on in to the renovation. <laughs> okay, so we are back and we are fixer uppering this house, except it's not a house. It's a it's a yacht club thing. I don't it's a lounge in the game. I don't I think it's supposed okay, so when I was at Sims Camp <laughs> They were talking about like why they built this lot and stuff and like why they placed this and how they built it to kind of like fit in the the neighborhood really well and how it's supposed to be like a wedding venue in the world, but it's like this yacht club thing and I just I think it's very cool. But <laughs> it I just it needed some help, you know? And so if you didn't know, I have this thing called the Simsy Save that I've been renovating like all the lots for and like I've just been if, if you didn't see it, I'll link the video down below. If I forget, it's it's just look up like Simsy Save and or check my like second most popular video and you'll find it. But I renovated every lot in The Sims 4 and made all new townies and stuff. I spent like three months on it and I'm in the process of working on that to update it for pets. Um, I just haven't exactly finished it yet because it's I'm, you know, in school and stuff. And so I, I'm working on it. This is one of the lots though that I've done for this. So in case you were curious, that's what this is for. Um, also, The Sims played in my Simsy save on stream yesterday. <laughs> Um, like actually like the Sims, like the Sim gurus, the Sims played in my Simsy save on stream yesterday. Um, and so basically what had happened was, um, I was streaming yesterday. So I had class at 1.30, right? And I was supposed to go to this like Thanksgiving thing last night. And so I couldn't stream, usually I stream on Tuesday nights, but I couldn't stream on Tuesday night because I had to go to this thing. And so I was going to stream like in the morning slash like early afternoon. So from like 11.15 to like one, my time before class. Um, so kind of like a short stream. I was playing Stardew Valley. And then I was just streaming, having a grand old time, hanging out, you know, and then people were like, hey, Kayla, The Sims is going to stream in your safe soon. And I was like, I'm sorry, what? <laughs> what What do you mean exactly by this? Because I was not told this was happening until it was happening. And so my chat was like, yeah, Kayla, The Sims just tweet like they're tweeting about it. Like the like Sim gurus are going to play in your safe. And so The Sims is doing this thing because if you didn't know, The Sims people like The Sim gurus stream on Twitch, um, usually like before an expansion pack comes out, like so they stream like cats and dogs in advance. Um, and they streamed like same thing with City Living. They just they stream like gameplay before the game comes out. 
Um, but they're starting these things called community streams where they're playing like in community created save files and stuff um, and letting the gurus just kind of like play the game, but in a save file that like the community has created for them. Um, and so I knew they were planning on doing this and I knew that like I had been asked to make a save file, but like I never sent anything over to them because I wasn't like, to I didn't know when I was supposed to do it or anything. So I never like sent anything. I didn't know when it was happening basically. And then all of a sudden my chat was like, yeah, they're going to stream in your, in your save file in like an hour. <laughs> and so I was like, hold on, you, what now? And so I kind of like freaked out on stream for a little bit because that's very exciting to me that like the sim gurus, the sims, you guys, like the actual sims was playing in my simsy save. Um, and so I ended up skipping class, which is, it sounds very bad. And I got hate for this last time I said this, but like, let's be real for a second. You guys, people skip class in college all the time. Like this is a thing that college students do. It's not a good thing, but it's a thing they do. And I don't skip class. Like I have never once skipped my psychology class. I always go to psychology. And so I, I missed it one time and it's Thanksgiving week. And so no one was going to be there. Like I already knew no one was going to be there. This is like a thing that happens with before breaks like no one goes to class and so like I can get the notes I'll be fine stop freaking out like I didn't I missed nothing okay I, I've been to this class I know what to expect anyway so I didn't go to class <laughs> I was going to but then um I ended up streaming like until the Sims started their stream so I streamed like an hour longer than I was supposed to and then I because they started they were gonna stream from like two my time to three my time and I had class from 1 30 to 2 45 and so I would have missed the entire it's like a 15 minute walk so I would have missed the entire stream um, and I, I wanted to see them playing in my save. That's really cool. <laughs> and so on stream, the whole chat, I was like, okay, guys, what do I do? Should I stay? Should I go to class or should I stay here and stream and then watch the stream? And the whole chat was like, Kayla, watch the stream. This is cool. And so I stayed and watched the stream. But like we, we streamed until they started their stream and then we rated it and then we all watched it together. And it was really cool. And I just, I don't know, man, it was a very cool, exciting thing. So the VOD is up on their Twitch still. If you want to like go back to the Sims on Twitch and then like look at their past broadcast, you can watch it back if you want. Um, but I mean, you know, <laughs> they just, they played in my save file. I have this, so I, what I did was I made like all new townies too, to fill all the empty lots and stuff. Um, I renovated all the community lots, all these things. And there's this one family I like a lot called, <laughs> called the not so classy. That's like the household title is not so classy. And it's the Sim Tabitha Rowe and her fiance, um, <laughs> named Jerry. And they've been engaged for a long time, but like never got married because plot twist, Jerry, I don't think he wants to marry Tabby, um, but, like, they've got a kid, and she's pregnant, and it's, like, a whole mess, um, and they ended up playing with her, <laughs> and it just, it was pretty great, um, to, like, see the sim guru was playing with my sim, and also ruining her life, but in the best way, um, and so that, that was a really cool thing that happened to me yesterday, happened to me yesterday, I can't speak, I'm sorry, also, I'm trying to, like, speed finish this video, because I'm supposed to go home for Thanksgiving, like, today, it's currently 9 30 a.m. when I'm recording this, um, on the day it's uploading. So I have to finish this video and then pack up my PC, PC can't talk setup and then go home uh, for Thanksgiving. So I'm, I'm kind of just waiting on finishing this before I can leave. And so I'm trying to speed finish it. It's just, ooh, okay. So the, the here's the deal. <laughs> I was supposed to build like a legit house for this or renovate like a house house in this world for this video. Um, and then I started it and I just, I couldn't finish it. I don't know what's wrong with me. I just, I, I had such little motivation to build this weekend and this week. Um, and so I just, I couldn't do it. I've had this built for, I built this, was the first one I renovated. So I built this like right when Cats and Dogs came out and I've kind of just been sitting on it for a while. I like to do that because I'll get in these moods where I just renovate community lots because they're fun to do. And then I like, I record it and I save it for a time like this when I just, for some reason, <laughs> can't build I don't know what's wrong with me. I just, I, I tried to build two houses, like, for Fixer Upper, and I just, I kept, like, building half of them, or, like, building, like, 30 minutes in, you know, into the recording, and then just being like, I can't do this, it's horrible, and then stopping. Um, I don't know why that happens to me, but just, there, I get in these, like, moods where I just can't do a Fixer Upper, and so luckily I had this to fall back on. Um, but it's, we're fine. It's fine. Really. We're fine. And now I'm trying to speed finish because I have to do this. Like last week I stayed up super late trying to finish the build. And then you guys know this happened last week too, because I, in the video I was like, yeah, I almost didn't post a fixer upper today. Yeah. Same thing today. I almost was this morning. I was kind of like, I don't want to do it. I hate it. I'm not going to do it. And then I realized that I didn't have a choice. And so I did it anyway. And now here we are. Um, I'm also going to get hate for complaining. Watch people love to hit, do that to me. Uh, but I get to go home for Thanksgiving, so that's really exciting, uh, very, very soon, and I, oh, I have to pack up my whole PC setup, which is a very stressful experience. <laughs>
<laughs> but I have to bring my PC back home so I can record while I'm at home because I didn't pre-record this week because I had tests and so I couldn't pre-record for Thanksgiving and so I have to do it at home. It's just, it's a lot of stuff is going on, but we're okay. Also, I can't stream from home because my internet is so terrible and it's very sad. Like, I want to stream, but I can't. <laughs> That's awful. Um, I don't know. It just, like, for me, streaming is just a lot of fun. Like, I just do it because it's fun. And so the fact that I can't stream makes me sad because I, I want to stream. But whatever. I'm going to try. I don't know if I can actually pull this off, so don't hold me to it. Um, but I'm going to try and stream, like, an IRL kind of deal from my phone. Because I can't stream, like, with my internet, but I can use my unlimited data. So I might do, like, an IRL, like, baking cookie stream with my sister later. Um, which would be, like, today today. I just don't know exactly what time. So when you're watching this, that could be over. Um, but, you know, you never know. Maybe I, maybe it's not over. Maybe I'm still doing it. Um, but... <laughs> I'm gonna try and do that today. Um, I'll let you know and then if it goes well I might do it again tomorrow when I'm baking for Thanksgiving But don't hold me to that because I don't know if it's gonna work or if I actually want to do it But part of me like really wants to do that. So um, we'll try. I know that I can stream from my phone It's just it's a matter of like How <laughs> am I gonna handle that? Um, but I asked my sister I was like Shanna you want to do like a, a baking cookie stream later and she was like yes And then she spoiled stranger things for me <laughs> So thank you Shanna for that because I was texting her and then she was like, oh my god This just happened and I was like Shanna. Why would you say that to me? I haven't seen stranger things season 2 yet. Like why did you do that? Um, so uh, she didn't know she means well she thought I watched it But I didn't because plot twist Shanna. I don't have time to watch TV nice try though um, I was gonna watch it this weekend over Thanksgiving break, but also I'm still trying to watch Game of Thrones and also I don't know if I want to watch TV this weekend because like my grandma's in town and stuff like I don't know if I want to watch you know we'll see we'll see um I just want to hang out with my dogs basically <laughs> I'm so excited to go home you guys this past week like this whole school week so like Monday Tuesday and now Wednesday like on Monday I only had to go to one class and I didn't go to class yesterday either because I ended up streaming so like I didn't even have to be here because my class on Monday I thought I had to go to it um because I usually have two but one got canceled and then it might, like same thing today they both got canceled today because I would have class on Wednesday too but like they both got canceled um but on Monday I only went because I thought we had a pop quiz because we always have pop quiz in that class and so I went so I wouldn't miss a pop quiz and then we didn't have a pop quiz and then she usually lectures but this time she had like this handout of vocabulary words it's my philosophy class it's horrible but she just had this handout she had written up so like she made like the notes for the class and then she just posted on the course website and then instead of lecturing she literally just stood there and read the handout out loud for an hour and 15 minutes and so I missed I could have not gone and missed nothing because she just read the hand like she didn't give any extra info she just read the handout for an hour and 15 minutes like picture like she put the list of words on the like projector and then she just read them for an hour and 15 minutes why did I go to class I could have been at home like all day on Monday I was thinking I was like I want to go home so bad I want to go home so bad I want to go home so bad and then I was going to stream Monday night and I couldn't so I went to class instead but like if I hadn't gone to class I didn't have to go to class because I can just read the words by myself plot twist I can read so I didn't have to go to class and listen to her read them because I got nothing extra from that isn't that so frustrating like I could have been home for Thanksgiving already like if this whole thing had happened like this this course of events I met I like, the, nothing I did in class this whole week was, was worthwhile staying for. Like, I could have been home. But instead, I was stuck here. So, shout out to philosophy for ruining my day. <laughs> no, but I was so mad in class after that. Because I, like, I waited the whole class period, too. So, I was like, maybe she'll do a quiz at the end. I don't know. Because I didn't want to miss a pop quiz. She didn't do one. So, I went to class for nothing. I just, the fact that she spent an entire class... I had, and it's from 4.30 to 5.45 p.m. So I stayed on campus all day. I could have gone home on Monday, but I stayed on campus all day because I was like, oh, I got class at 4.30 p.m., which is horrible. And so I waited all day. The whole day I was just like, I want to go home so bad, but I'm stuck here. Like the whole day I was thinking that. And then I went to class and it was worthless. <laughs> like I didn't have to go. I was so upset. Um, I just, I can't believe that she just stood there and read out the words from this handout. Like I have never seen a professor or a teacher at all do anything like that like she could have been like hey guys there's a handout of words you need to know check it out and even like pulled up and been like here are the words but here's the link to it but no instead she just stood there and read them all like what kind of lecture is that <sighs> i can't believe i had to go to that I'm, I'm still mad about it anyway um 
it's fine because usually like she'll lecture I don't know she's kind of an awful professor like she usually lectures like I don't think she comes to class with a plan is the thing I think that she just comes to class and then decides what to talk about once she gets there um which is sort of ridiculous but usually she goes on these tangents about philosophy and she's like well you might not need to know this and then she writes the test after like okay so here's a here's an example we had a, a review for our last exam in class oh, i say review in air quotes okay because we got there and the premise of a like a test review usually is like to come and ask questions about the test and like what to expect and stuff and so we had the test on wednesday class on monday was this review i say in air quotes again right we get there and people are like so how many questions is it and she was like oh i don't know i haven't written it yet and they're like, oh, <laughs> well, how many essay questions? And she's like, I don't know, I haven't written it yet. <laughs> and so all the questions that people were asking about the test, she was like, oh, I don't know, I haven't written it yet. And so she didn't have any answers. And then they'd be like, oh, so like, do we need to know about like this? At, like, what which of the things we've read so far this year do we need to know about? And she's like, oh, I don't know, I haven't written it yet. <laughs> and so the whole class period, we had to be there to supposedly ask questions about the exam. She would just be like, oh, you know, I'm not sure, haven't written it yet, but I'll, you'll find out on Wednesday. <laughs> like, what kind of wasted class period? And then um, people would ask a question, and she was like, oh, I'm not going to answer that because it's probably going to be on the test. <laughs> like, what? what's the point of having the review then? Like, you wouldn't answer anybody's questions, but you purposefully held this review session before the test. Like, what are you doing? Ugh, it was such a waste of a class period. I like every time I go there, I'm like, I'm wasting my time. Like this, I, no one needs to be here right now. But she gives these pop quizzes, so you go to class just in case, and then it's worthless <laughs> because you get no new information. Because the thing is, like the class, we we do all like ever it's all of it's based on readings, like a philosophy stuff. So it's like an essay or like some whatever. Like so, it's all based on the readings, and then these le like these lectures. I say in air quotes again because nothing she's saying in class matters. Who? sorry, I don't know how I got on this tangent. I just, I've never been in a class like this <laughs> that feels so like worthless to go to. Um, anyway, it just, I can't believe, like nothing she does matters. Okay, I'll stop, I'll stop. <laughs> oh my God, it's fine. I'm fine, really, I'm not upset. <laughs> I just, I could have been home on Monday and I've been here since then. That makes me so sad. Like, I've been wanting to go home for so long, but I, I could have gone home on Monday morning, like Monday morning, but now it's Wednesday and I'm not going to be home until the afternoon because of philosophy. <laughs> I'm fine, really. Anyway, um, this lot, wow, it's cute, right? <laughs> I don't know how I was not supposed to do this rant on, the, on philosophy today. I was not supposed to do that. Because um, the thing is, I like the subject a lot. I just, the professor is horrible. <sighs> I'm fine really it's fine <laughs> Whew, okay we're good it's good it's all good we're almost done with the build which is which is also good i get to go home soon which is also good i get to see my dogs which is gonna be great um possibly stream some baking cookies with my sister <laughs> which should be interesting um things are looking up but anyway thanksgiving is on thursday in the US, in case you're like elsewhere and don't know what's going on, I'm going home for Thanksgiving. Um, and so I'm gonna be home until Sunday, which is fun. And so videos, I'm gonna be recording face cam videos back in my bedroom, or po I mean, I might set up my PC like upstairs um, where the Wi Fi router is so that I can try and get an Ethernet connection because otherwise I can't do anything because um, our Wi Fi is so bad. Um, but, like, I can't get a, a cord into my room because it's so far away. But, like, I might try and set it up upstairs. So, in which case, weird video backgrounds this weekend. But I'm, we'll see. We'll give it a shot. I, I make no promises. But there's going to be videos at home. But I'm really excited to, like, go home and record. But I have to, like, bring my whole PC setup back, which is fun. Um, but I left, like, a couple old monitors at home. Because I, I got new monitors, like, two months ago. And so I, maybe it's just, like, a month ago. But I left the old ones at home. And so I don't have to bring my monitors back. Because the monitor is the worst part of transporting my PC, I think. Because I'm so scared of scratching them. That, like, I don't know. I just, like, wrap them in blankets. It's, like, it's a whole thing. But when I just bring my PC back, I have, like, a box of cords. And then my PC. And it's fine to, like, transport. Because she travels well. Um, so far. <laughs> I've done it a few times now. <laughs> um, but it always scares me. Because, like, moving my PC setup is terrifying because I don't want to mess anything up because like she's my child I need her <laughs> and she's very expensive um but it, she'll be fine well I'm calling it a she I did this around like some new people the other day and they were like is is your pc a girl and I was like yeah it's a she <laughs> and then they judged me and asked what her name was she doesn't have a name she just 
it's just my PC. But I call her a she. I call everything a she or a he. I call, you know, I do that. I don't know why. I just, these inanimate objects, I keep giving, like, pronouns. I should stop. Anyway, video's almost over, you guys. Video. I can't talk, see? Going way downhill. Make sure to leave a like and comment and subscribe and do all the fun YouTube things. And in case you guys didn't know, I post new videos every single day. And so I will see you all tomorrow. Bye, everybody. Do you think people will complain about me complaining in this video? Cause that keeps happening to me. And like, you know what you guys, I just, I need a, a forum to complain sometimes, okay? Because I just, that's what this is, right? This is like my personal complaining diary, right? <laughs> that's how that works, right?